was doing. Dirty Ezio here for High Tech Legion. And we're going to be go ahead and, you know, kind of unbox something for you today. And I hope you like it. It's my first one. It's the first shot I got here at High Tech Legion to unbox a product for you. And today we're going to be unboxing a laptop cooler. You know, laptop coolers, some of you might not want to use. Some of you might want to use them. They can come in handy at times. Now, I'll tell you a little story about me. You know, at night, when I'm at home and I'm relaxing with the wife and everything like that, and, you know, I got to do a little bit of work. I turn on my laptop, and then after about two or three hours, my wife's butt starts to get warm because the, the laptop, you know, that I got laying over there, it kind of gets warms her butt up, so I got to take it off and put it on the table. But when I put it on the table over there, what happens is the heat sometimes starts melting the, uh, you know, the, the formica or whatever it is. So that's when you're going to need to use a laptop cooler. But some people just like the fact that they have it off their table and everything like that. So today we're going to take a look at the NZX Cryo. NZXT Cryo, not the NZX, you know, it's NZXT. The NZXT Cryo V60. This is a nice laptop cooler. It's got two fans in them. They're 75 millimeter blower fans. They're, they could go anywhere from 1000 to 1600 RPMs and that's adjustable, you know? It supports about a 16 inch laptop. It's got a three piece USB charger port. The power button, of course. A built in fan controller, as I said, it's adjustable to fan speeds. It's got an LED to tell you when it's on or off after you hit the power button. And it also has plastic and rubber grommets on it. You know, the feet of plastic and rubber, blah, blah, blah. And it comes in black and white. Now, this is the box. It comes in a white box with orange and gray, as you can see. That's the back of the box. The front of the box actually shows a picture of what's inside the box. All right. Now, we could also flip that open. And when we flip that open, you can see a little bit of the inside. But we're not worried about flipping it open and seeing a little bit of the inside because, you know, you, you, got, some, you got some languages up here. And I, it, some of them I don't read. So, you know, hey, what are you going to do? But let's go ahead. We open the box. And then when we open the box, it looks like that. So we take the box, we open it. And inside... There's the laptop cooler, all right? Then we got the USB cable. And then, not only that, here we go. You got your manual for the instructions. Now, normally I just throw these things out. I don't really read them because, you know, we got the smarts in my family. You know what I mean? But just in case you need these, they got it. It's in there. So we throw it over there. This is the USB cable. You plug this into your laptop. You plug this one into the laptop cooler. It works. I'll show you how to do that in a minute or two. Then we go ahead and we look at this. Now, you know, you got these plastic things on the outside. I don't need them. So, hey, mana chalamizea. We go ahead and we throw them out. And then we go ahead and we take the plastic off. And then we take another piece of plastic off and take a look at it. And boy, oh boy, let me tell you. Look at the piano finish on this thing. It's nice and shiny. Now, very light. It's got a nice hole in it. Now, if you decide that you're going to use your wife's butt to put it on, It'll make, at least keep that little area over there nice and cool. And then maybe she won't have a problem. She'll lay in front of you. You could play on the, you know, you play a game. You do your work and everything like that. But in any case, we take a look at it. Nice piano finish. If we look over on the sides, there's the connectors. We're going to be taking a closer look at this in a few seconds. But it's light. It's got some vent holes in the back here. We got the nice hole, and I'll tell you what this hole's for. You have two fans on each side here. What they do is they create airflow, and it creates the flow here through the air, and also it can create a suction to pull the hot air out. So that's what it does. Does it work? We're gonna test it, we'll find out. But now on the back, 
as you can see it's got four nice rubber feet for you to go ahead and make sure it's nice and sturdy so it doesn't move on the table and then we can take a laptop we go ahead and put the laptop on top now you can see how nice that is it's beautiful on there and you got a little bit of a footstool here so it doesn't slide down on you all right we put that there we take this off over here you know just a few things that you got to do you know throw it out and then okay what side do i want to put this on okay we'll put it over here we're going to go ahead and we're going to plug this in to our usb port and then once i have the computer on uh oh how the hell are these things open we're going to go ahead and turn it on and I'm going to type in my secret password. And if you could guess the secret password, maybe I'll tell you later. But we're resuming Windows here. And then, okay, how much time are you going to take? Secret password, G, where the heck is the other one? Hey. Right. Hmm. I don't know. I'm having a problem here. I'm looking upside down. Let me turn it the other way. Hey, just so you know, the password's Mumbai. But in any case, there you go. Now, we got this all there. Okay. Now, you're going to see an LED kind of, kind of flip on over there. The fan makes a little bit of noise when it's on high. I don't know if you can hear that, but I will tell you this much, it works. But when you put it on low, it's virtually noiseless. All right, so now we're going to go ahead and we're going to take a closer look at the actual piece itself. We're going to take a look at the NZXT Cryo V60. Nice close look. All right, now that we've taken a closer look and we looked at some benchmarks for the NZXD Cryo V60, let me give you my impressions on it. I actually kind of like it. It's not bad. I'm not, I'm not very much, you know, myself, the laptop cooler type of guy. But at times that I do need something, it's lightweight. It'll fit in my bag. It's easy to transport. It works well. It's got some nice features to it. I like the piano black. I like the fact that it has the vent holes in the back. I like the little thing, you know, this kind of looks like that, that guy who made that fan, you know, you put your hand through there. But in any case, on the Dirty Ezio scale of rating, we're going to go ahead, out of a scale of one to five, we're going to go ahead and give this three blast knuckles. Three brass knuckles, okay? Five being the best of the brass knuckles, this one is going to get three brass knuckles. You know, knuckles, whatever it is, whatever the hell you want to call it. But in any case, thank you for watching the video. And remember this, at High Tech Legion, we do unboxing Goomba style. Take it easy. Bye-bye.